Ooh, it's gonna be a tough one. I can tell you that. You may need to sit down for this one. It appears that you run out of options on trying to fix the situation. It has left you with no choice, but let's just say to call it quits first. For now, the distance is needed or the separation. Because you don't know what you can do to make it work. There's nothing really for you. I mean, at least right now. You're saying that you're more on the anxiousness, okay, on what you have found out. Now, what you found out, you felt betrayed. So, I don't know what that is, but you definitely are hurting. Okay, Libra. Let's see what you guys have. I'm Sal. I do readings here every day for your career, finances, and your daily horoscope. So, you're going to see this, and you can also learn how to manifest with me um, every day um, because I teach different things about gemstones and crystals that you can get actually from our uh, wonderful store here in Los Angeles or at our website at eatreadlove.me. So, I'll teach you later how to manifest. Whatever you're manifesting, we'll work together. Well, first, I feel like eight, ten of swords here in the eight of swords, you may be wanting to manifest some sort of healing. How do you bring this to reality? Um, this is about mind consciousness because the swords are thoughts and Eight of Swords is uh, also going around in cycles. So you may be suffering from repetitive feeling of like betrayed. Um, well, one, you know, like your person wasn't loyal. So it's kind of hard to recover from that. You feel that there is no way that I'm, I can continue, you know, not, you know, not just with them, like. Right now, I, I sense a deep feeling of hopelessness. Now, on your person's end here with the Three of Wands and the Four of Swords, they be thinking about you, okay? They be waiting for you to open up. I'm not sure if you're ready for that because of how, you know, how the situation has panned out. So it's pretty tragic. I'm not sure why a person thinks that it's going to be easy for the two of you to just be back together. I don't know if it's a reconciliation, but... Your person is thinking about the good old times because the Four of Swords is here. There are certain memories that your person is relieving inside their head. Okay. You're 50-50 on this one. The Fool card and the Five of Swords. You don't really know at this point if it's even worth it because you have the Five of Wands here which is the part where... Well... They have a lot of things that they bring to the table that you don't like. Complaints, hardship. You know, they're not easy to be with there. We all choose the people that we want to be with, but we're only we're not choosing based on like, oh, it's only just means only gonna be good, so I choose them. But it's this one is unnecessary. The five of ones. And that's why the fool for you, it's just like, am I stupid? You know, like, you can be with a person with a hardship, but their hardship is... Uh, how do you say this? It's more of, like, excuses. It's not really, like, a problem. It make, make sense? Mm. So you isolated yourself with the hermit and the tower. You are now taking a step back. Hermit and the tower. This is showing now... That in your situation, you feel that, okay, let's see here. Hermit Tower, mm. like, I need some time out. It was a very terrible experience for you. You are seeking now some sort of enlightenment. So this is how bad it was. It brought you closer to God. Mm. Hermit with the Tower. I mean, like, you know, like how we get challenges and then now that you got into this challenge, then you realize the value of spirituality or religion. I'm not saying that you were far from it, but I'm just saying it built closer connection to your creator, to God. You never thought that this could happen to you or that your person will do this to you. Oh. <laughs> it does look like here in your situation, your person is not even sorry about it. Because there's a sense of anger I sense from them and frustration. High priestess in the Five of Swords, if they're not talking to you, it's because of 
they want to teach you some sort of lesson. Like this is, uh, is that not vendetta, but a vengeful kind of energy. 60% off this Black Friday. My retail store and online business, I manifested using Jade Bracelet. I manifested this house using a citrine bracelet. Over 100,000 sold citrine, jade, pink opal, tiger's eye, amethyst, red coral, obsidian. Order now at eatreadlove.me and get your free citrine bracelet. It's a very vengeful kind of energy with the five of swords there and the high priestess. And the thing is your person knows what you want from them and you want to have either a serious conversation, ace of pentacles with the six of wands. So for you right now, the way I see this is that, okay, yeah, your person has been taking you for granted Oof, and you're on the defense about it. You know what would be a good treat for you right now, Libra, okay, is what you're seeing here in front of you. This is our forever fortune crystal bracelet. I would choose for you if it's about removing this person because this is a 60% off right now is the black obsidian. Definitely go for a black obsidian. If there's anything that you want to block off, wear it on your left wrist and then your healing journey starts and your manifestation basically for a good life can begin. So we do ship this for free in the U.S. and at the same time it comes with a free citrine and we also ship to more than 80 countries across the globe. Now let me teach you about how you're manifesting with the black obsidian. The black obsidian is a crystal that removes karmic, karmic kind of connection. It doesn't cut it, cut it. But it, you know, they can be removed from your energy. Let's just say you know that you're good already and you're trying to be free with the full card, right? So I'll teach you how a crystal works, you know, crystal work for me. Not crystal, crystal work. I'm sorry. So, and if you're just going to be upset, then, you know, go back to whatever this person is. Meaning it's like, oh, I just want a reading. Well, I teach more than the reading. So the reading is here. But, you know, like some people think that an hour read changes their life. I only need a minute and I already know what's going to happen to you. And why spend an hour on a read when the person doesn't even think about you for just a minute? So, and then you want an hour? Wake up. So the obsidian here, which I highly recommend for you, is for your own growth, for your own good. Okay, now you know me, I always wear citrine. So that's not something that I would recommend for you right now. The double piao blocks, removes the blockages and blocks any kind of unwanted energy. You're suffering from this because you have a nine of wands here. The nine of cups here shows that your person is self litigious And not just that, they've been using you multiple times, the seven of cups. And I feel like they are a habitual liar. Mm -hmm. Reading alone is not enough. You need to take action, okay? And how I help people here is I help them use different kinds of gemstones to manifest something good in their life. So now that you're in the path of manifestation, you choose something that connects with you. That's what I want. I want you to find something at the store that will connect you to your higher self because the, magic the magician can do anything. And I feel like you're stuck in the situation, but don't worry, I'm here every day. So let's work together. I'll see you tomorrow. Hold on, hold on, you're here already and I have a free class for manifestation of love and money. And if you are serious, there's a free class in the description box below. Join me and learn more on how to manifest with a real gold piao.